Good morning, everyone. I'm taking over the channel today and I just thought you need to remember, thank you next. So today we're doing a Harry Potter tour, which means walking around Edinburgh and going, that was filmed there. No, it going, wasn't oh, it was filmed, it was what inspired things. Did you know that JK Rowling wrote that bit book there? Did you know that right woman there. from Fairy Tale of New York got a decapitated? Oh my god! <laughs> it's mad. Did you know that Edinburgh Castle's right there? Yeah. Edinburgh Castle is everywhere. Right there. Edinburgh yeah. Castle is in my soul. But you started saying castle because I say castle. Did I say castle? You just yeah. said castle. Edinburgh castle. 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 Yeah, then what? And then we go to the cathedral. We walk down the Royal Mile. We take a lovely stroll in the rain. And then we might be going to Obscura, which is where it's lots of illusions and it hurts your brain. It's to really talent, ta challenge us mentally. Then what do we do? Uh, Are we gonna eat at the mash place? So we're gonna get some lovely mash because it is the number one street food restaurant in the UK. Oh, wow, Meg would have fun facts. You have to like and subscribe, even if this video goes up in four years. Which it probably will. Ring the bell and um, comment below your favorite type of potato. mashed potato. <laughs> no, your favorite type of potato. Mash, mash bros, mash. 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 Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> it's on the stick? Yeah. yeah I think mine's definitely roast potatoes. I'm ending the vlog now. Bye. Very cold. It's rainy. That's a graveyard. I'm filming a graveyard. That's good, isn't it? Oh yeah, they said to one of the ingredients, this is loads of names of characters. Yeah, we might go through in the, in the tour, you know. Probably. No, dead people's names that have inspired Harry Potter characters. That's what we're going to look at. Well, authors have got to get their ideas from somewhere, haven't they? I'm quite excited for this match later on. I want to try those veggie haggis. Because it's veggie, it's not actual like sheep intestines. But it's still haggis, so technically, I'm fulfilling the requirement of eating haggis whilst I'm in Scotland. Neeps and tatties. What are neeps? What are they? Sweet! Ah, thank you. What do you mean, what sweet, for God's sake? Sweet is the big, the big round thing. Is it a squash? No. No, it's sweet. Vegetable, root vegetable. Castle. I know what a Swede is. At least I know what a Swede is. And then for Christmas, she would give me a squash. <laughs> what? Ten year old me would receive a squash. If we go into a supermarket, Meg, I can point out a Swede to you. You want to ask me what a Swede is, Meg? <laughs> Wait, it's it's crazy. Crazy. Everyone Everyone Do you I'm just gonna do one candle for everyone. Can't be doing five. Pula Juice Cafe. Oh, it's cute. Right? Sweet potato chili and coconut soup. Oh, that sounds good to me. Yeah, if that's all right. Four of us. Oh, perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yummy. Yeah. Wow. So I had sweet potato, chili, and coconut. You had tomato basil soup and then harissa chicken. Poppy had the same. Very good. Out of ten, like a solid ten. Really? Yes, yeah, really nice. And Meg had uh, hummus with a little peppers and things, and I put harissa chicken in it. Nice, chicken because is she is a meat eater. I'm a meat eater. Mm -mm. I'm scared to mm. eat it.
Oh my god, it's her bag! Wow! Yeah, this is the one that, that she fits everything in. Oh, the crystal goblet from the, from the cave. The emotional range of a teaspoon! Ah, oh, so good! So, um, I've just seen a psychopath. Oh. So they got the little tub of Nivea Soft, which yeah. is like for your face. Yeah. <laughs> all over her lips. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at all the wands, all the wands. I love new spinanders wands. And if you They are not ugly. <laughs> I like both of them. This is so cool. That looks soft. That's a nice yeah. house scarf. Oh, the Slytherin. Slytherin. Yeah. I went to the exhibition that was at um, the British Library. I think this is it. I think we found it. We've got our tickets for the tour. I'm number 13. Ooh. Three Harry Potter tour. Diagonally. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it tells you the story of Greyfriars Bobby there. Yeah. Wow. The view is amazing because you've seen all like the back, the back of everywhere. It really is beautiful, isn't it? Wow. Welcome to the Greyfriars Courtyard, and yeah, it's got a lot of dead people. <laughs> There's also stones, and these stones have names, and many of these names are said to have inspired cats in the High Potter universe. I know at least one of these is definitely correct, but I'll be telling you about several of the other ones, so we're going to do that. There are names in the stones, you see the names? I will give house points. I like giving house points at this stage. This is the part where you really get a lot of house points. So, eyes peeled, eyes peeled. Moody. 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 The name for the aura Alistair Midian is based on this stone. Well, try almost every second person in Scotland. I had three teachers at my primary school who were called Moody. It's a very common name in Scotland. On this stone right next to it is named Euphemia. And here's a fun fact about Euphemia. Euphemia Potter was Harry Potter's paternal grandmother. Huh? She was married to a guy called Flamit Potter. Good name. <laughs> uh, and they came up with potions. One particular potion was very successful and why Harry Potter has so much money. Sleekies. The hair potion. That's right. That's why Harry Potter's got all that money, because his family sells hair tonic. Thomas Riddle Esquire, or Thomas Riddell Esquire is what he had pronounced. Who was Thomas Riddell Esquire? Well, in the Harry Potter universe, is Voldemort's muggle name. Right, besides the fact that we're all freezing, <laughs> how, how did we rate the tour? 10 out of 10. It was yeah, really Fraser, good. Fraser, I loved him. And I learned, yeah, very informative. And I learned lots of things that I didn't already know about Harry Potter. So that's cool. Just walking actually is making my feet warm up again, you know? Yeah. My fingers are a bit numb though. Oh, we're going to walk past the Harry Potter cafe again. So on this tour, there was a woman that did not stop brushing her hair the entire tour. An hour and a half she was brushing her hair. I was like, <laughs> are you okay? So it was a lot. Yeah. Oh, look. Okay, here's the Harry Potter cafe where JK Rowling supposedly wrote the Harry Potter books. The elephanted house. Birthplace of Harry Potter. Very cute. Yes. This is what we need. Look at the, the little pot of Nutella. A little gun. For a little person. <laughs> <laughs> so, I ordered a lemon and sugar crepe. It arrives. I bite into it and I go, that is definitely a salted lemon crepe. Or oh, I said to the waitress, it's definitely salt in this. And she went, okay. She took it back. They tried it. And she came back and she went, they will get you a new crepe. <laughs> and then I've just been given a biscuit, biscuits in compensation. That's like the most basic rookie error. <laughs> Hopefully the next one's better. 
This one's better. A lot better. Very good. Oh. Oh. Mm. Wow. Wow. Yes. <laughs> Where did you get binoculars from? I stole them. Oh my god. I to dip my coat up. My fingers are numb. You've got it's no very, time. Quick. Very difficult. Oh. 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 I can't see it at all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right now, okay, I see I see Poppy and Meg. I feel like I'm interrogating you at a... Right now, I definitely see Poppy and Meg. I can't see you now. Oh, now I see your ass. Is it to do with lights? Yeah. We're too similar. We're too similar. I was just looking at that. I was lining our faces up and we are literally... That's really oh my God, scary. This is, like, is going to be swap faces on Snapchat, like you merge faces. Yeah. <laughs> ooh, ooh, that's terrifying. That's just me. Why is that ooh? That's just my face. No job. <laughs> oh, I love these. Uh, it's running backwards. It's it. Run it's running. <laughs> now just walk backwards. <laughs> now just wiggle your legs. <laughs> Your face is like massive. Oh my God. There's a lot of Megs. <laughs> <laughs> what a world. What a world. Skinny legend. Incredible. Skinny legend world. Wow. You ready? Yeah, you're doing so, magic. Look, this bulb is crap and it doesn't work. So I'm going to use my static charge. It's turn on. I don't know. Wow. I really don't know. No way. What? Is that electricity flowing through you and me into that? Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> no, 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 don't like that. that so if I touch Meg, do you know what happens? I don't want to die. Ready? Go on. Go <laughs> <laughs> on, go. I'll never tell her, ready? Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah! <laughs> and that is the Bible story. <laughs> Just put your hand in there, go on. This will be a live animal. Look, live animals warning. What if it is a live animal? Go on. I feel really uncomfortable. <laughs> They're always fun. This is live for you. Yeah. Imagine oh my gosh. I'm so 
glad we found that. <laughs> Oh my Very god. Exactly. It's just in a, in a so window. Now, like, this has to be an eagle. Look how far away we are, please. Look. <gasps> no. <gasps> Mirror maze. Yeah. I'm ready. Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Round and round the ball will spin till it draws your good luck in. Ah, I can foretell for you good luck in a month or two. That's nice. <laughs> the crystal gazer has wonderful things in store for you. A dear one will return from a long trip and your whole life will be different. Your calm spirit and your good sense will see you through all emergencies. You have many friends, particularly in the armed forces. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> they are loyal to you and are glad of an opportunity to be of service to you. Your lucky numbers are 3, 26, 6, 44, 21 and 12. That's a lot of numbers. Oh,